what's up guys i am at a pretty awesome super unique listing in keala kikua bay of uh, bay estates we're on broker's caravan today so you're going to see a bunch of other people you have two lots each with a house combined into one compound uh, i'm gonna put all the details down in the description below there's a lot to it so i'm going to kind of run through but i basically got uh, two lots a little over an acre each so over two acres incredible views uh, massive property so here's the first house connects all the way up to the living area upstairs and then sorry circle drive the second house the playhouse all this beautiful landscaping huge lawn these ginormous i'm not exactly sure what kind of trees those are and then views down into kealakekua bay and the ocean there so um we're going to kind of run through quickly if this is something that you're interested in give me a call drop me an email mike drew to our principal broker owner next home paradise realty uh, i'll come out and do a more in-depth video for you uh, based on the things that you're telling me that you need so we come in the front door downstairs we have a couple bedrooms down here bedroom one Let's see if we can keep count of all these bedrooms access outside looks great large huge storage area down here pushing through here bedroom number two downstairs good size plenty of space uh little landing area out here wonderful landscaping check this out i mean you are in hawaii Look at all that ginger everywhere beautiful so marriott trees pineapple trees i'd say this is about a 15 by 10 bedroom good size on there bathroom and then come over in here a little living seating play area mini fridge and then nice little exercise room here check out the um, good job on the louvered windows here very very handy so when you got you know most of the time you got good breezes you just open those guys up plenty of airflow better than a regular window where you slide it up well still half of that window is closed right this lets the whole window area be open and then downstairs pool area we got our outdoor grill got a viking spiral staircase going upstairs where we will go next hot tub pool this is a pretty good lap pool i'd say we're about 40 feet long or so and then for the kids you got your slide man Shout out for putting in a slide. I haven't seen a slide in a pool in forever. Now, when I was growing up, that was pretty common. Uh, you know, insurance guys don't really probably dig slides. All right. Now, I'm going to go up the spiral staircase here and take a look upstairs. Oh man, really good job on this space. So massive, massive space here. Uh, like the little built-ins that they've done. Plenty of room to display artwork. Huge vaulted ceilings. Tongue and groove. The exposed wood beams. Looks great. Got our pocket Fleetwood doors. So we got screens and glass. And then I think this is what you're wanting to see. Massive covered lanai all the way down into Kealakekua Bay. I'm gonna zoom in here a little bit. So you can see Captain Cook Monument down there. And that's where the snorkel boats go. I see a bunch of kayaks. I see two boats and a third one coming on in. Really popular place. Absolutely amazing, incredible, spectacular views. We've got our swimming pool down there below. Telescope. Nice. All right. So this room here that I'm looking at, uh, boy. 
28 feet wide maybe. Really good size. This thing is going to go pretty quick. We're listed over 2 million. I'll get the exact details below. Oh, here we go. Here's our sheet. 2.3 million. 6,055 square feet of living space. Pretty nice. All right, coming in here into our kitchen. We've got good size corning countertops, cooktop on the island, blonde wood, natural looking. You may want to do some updating on some of the tile. If it's me, I'm, I'm updating that green. I might even switch to a quartz countertop and lower that. I mean, it's good as it is right now, but you might want to uh, upgrade depending on what your needs are. KitchenAid microwave and stove. Plenty of storage over here. Built in, there's your pantry. They've got this set up. Real wood floors down here, guys. Real wood, nice. Office area, not sacrificing a bedroom for the office. Water closet right here. Small dining area, breakfast nook. Nice little Nanai out here, Trex decking. I think you're looking at about a 15 by 15, maybe 14 by 14 foot Lanai. Looks like we got some avocados. Oh no, mangoes up there. So we had our two bedrooms downstairs. We have this sort of uh, connector over to our owner's suite, which is above the two car garage. I'm not gonna show you the garage because it's just a garage. Up here into our owner's suite. Even higher, the view gets even better. Got great size in here. Uh, I can count the tiles, but I think we're looking at about 18 by 12 with covered lanai. See who's coming up the driveway, even, even better views. Um, really nice. Still got the whole second house to go to over there, guys. Coming in here through the owner's bathroom. Dual sinks, corning countertops with the built-in sink on that. We got a large jetted tub. There's a pink hue. It's coming out a little bit more pink on camera than it is in person, so just be aware of that. And a single person shower over here. Privacy door for our water closet. And then right on the other side, pretty decent size here for our walk-in closet. And boy, extra space here. So yeah, you could do something else in here. Maybe they have this as a sitting room. I'm not really sure, but I would just expand the closet if it was me. Or maybe reconfigure the closet and expand the shower. That's what I would do. So one thing that's really cool, this is important. When you're looking at these, these homes, we see these open beam ceilings. There's very few walls you'll find that are structurally supporting uh, the roof. That allows you to move these things around quite a bit. And you may have noticed back when we were in the kitchen living area, uh, there was a wall there that did not go all the way to the ceiling. That's because it's just, it's just there to be a divider. That's something that you can do on these homes where you can just sort of move walls around wherever you need them. It makes it really easy to reconfigure. Okay, I'm going to pick it back up at the other house. Okay, so now I'm up at the, uh, call it the second home. It's the second structure. It's got two bedrooms, but there's going to be some stuff in here that's going to absolutely blow you away. Um, you got to see this. This is incredible. All right. This is my kind of house. So we got all the view. The view is actually, to me, even better here. It's more wide because the trees... Uh, the tall trees that we have frame the view, and it's more open directly in front of you. Absolutely incredible. Covered lanai. Great. Let's walk in here. And uh, if you have a lot of friends, and you like to have a good time with those friends, you're going to like this. Large area here. We're looking at 50 feet or so. Billiard room. Billiard table. Plenty of room to install more stuff. Check that out. A little mini fridge, a stove, a little small dishwasher, 
plenty of storage, it's a great bar. Okay, back to checking out this bar. We've got about 14 feet on the bar. The thing I really like about it is uh, your friends, guests can sit here and have that view looking outside. Pretty impressive. And you still have plenty of room over here. You know, they could really do a lot more down here if they wanted. It's pretty open right now. Um, but, you know, they got a little poker table, chair, uh, couch over there, jukebox, popcorn machine. What's the popcorn machine for? We'll get to that. View really just keeps looking great. Come and check out. We also have in the guest house here a couple bedrooms. So this one they got a bunk bed, queen bed, a couple of mix and match furniture pieces. Uh, to me this is kind of like you know, you could, updo, you could upgrade it a little bit. It's sort of a, a bit of a crash pad, like a place just to let the kids stay. So this is kind of a, get a bunch of people sleeping here. We got good sides on these. Uh, you could reconfigure this however you want. Uh, plenty of windows, so you got lots of airflow. At this elevation, it's nice and cool. And you got the breeze that comes upstairs, or uphill from the ocean below, so it looks great. We have our bathroom downstairs here. Do a little cleaning up, nothing major. We got a shower here, super, uh, just basic. It's a slide in uh, plastic unit and a privacy door on our water closet here. So that's our downstairs. So we had our popcorn. Why do you keep popcorn? Why do you have a popcorn machine? Hmm, where do you eat popcorn? Tickets? <laughs> there you go. It's showtime, baby. Here is, boy, that's like a hundred inch or so. Your theater room. And boy, they have this thing done up for real, I swear. This looks like, this is the carpet that you see in the theater. And then check out these chairs. You have five luxury recliner chairs with cup holders. Look how much these things recline back if you want. Awesome. And then seven more standard chairs for the cheap seats up in the back. You got an AC for this. We got curtains over there, over here. Incredible sound system. These curtains help with the echo. Look, look at the attention to detail here. They even got the lights down here on the steps. Even got a little handrail here. Pretty awesome. There's even a hidden door here, which goes outside to a ramp so that if the stairs are tough for you, we still have access here. So I think your friends would love this. The kids would love this. Your friends' kids would love this. You are going to be uh, making some pretty awesome memories here at the Fun House. All right, guys, thanks for staying with me on this. A pretty unique house. List at 2.3 million. Give me a call, drop me an email if this is something that you're interested in. Um, you know, there's a few things you can do to update it change the look a little bit, some furniture, a couple uh, surfaces, you know, things like that. But there's not going to be another thing like this on the market for quite some time. All right, guys. Thanks a lot. Aloha.